Nairobi Expressway has become one of the famous spoken vias along East African region. The expressway has facilitated a lot to reduce congestion along the roads in Nairobi. However, today I want to show you the other side of it that many people diverge from main roads and they take this expressway where they pay about 360 Kenyan shillings that's almost $36 and they think they are escaping congestion but many times a lot of people think the same and today morning I was passing along this road and then I saw how much it was difficult to go uh, to pass through this road especially where you have to get out of the road to pay uh, to pay road toll then there is where the complication starts because along the way you slide but when you reach here and you want to go out you have to spend some minutes waiting for the other vehicles to pay for the service and then this caused this morning at least in this area of museum a lot of congestion of cars that were supposed to drive off from the expressway so as you can see the road seems to be very busy that there are a lot of congestion in this area whereas the normal ways we are moving just as normal without any congestion so I want to conclude you that sometimes it's easier to pass the normal routes and sometimes it is necessary that you take the expressway but however for day like today it was easier and it was better just to cruise uh, along the normal roads and to divert from the Nairobi Expressway so thank you for follow up you can comment if you have any personal experience of a Nairobi Expressway you are welcome if you have challenges share to us so that we may air next time in a better way right now i leave you with a general congestion or transit along Waiyaki road and this is the way towards westlands i'm going to pass through Waiyaki Road towards Westland. So welcome, thank you for your company. Don't forget to subscribe. We are together.